How's it going guys, it's Darren here, and welcome to another tutorial. Um, I made one yesterday about Counter-Strike, Global Offensive and trading. Today I'm doing something fairly different. I'm making one basically teaching you how to play American Truck Simulator Multiplayer, which was released earlier today. Um, I've played it, it's really cool. Um, this tutorial actually works for Euro Truck Multiplayer, so if you'd like to, just follow exactly what I do, and you'll be able to play. So one thing I will say, or two things I will say. First thing, you need two hours of gameplay on American Truck Simulator single player um, in order to be able to play the multiplayer. If not, you won't be able to. It won't allow you. You won't have access or anything. It just will not let you in. Secondly, if you're banned on Euro Truck Multiplayer, it won't allow you on American Truck Multiplayer. So if you're banned or you don't have two hours gameplay, you can't play. I mean, when you're unbanned, you can play, and when you've got two hours gameplay, you will be able to play. So, let's get started. First, this link will be in the description, and it will take you to Truckers MP. Um, this is the new website, it's very nice, they've worked very hard on it. Um, and this is where you get both of the mods. So you go to the main page, and you're going to want to make a new account, uh, just call yourself whatever. If you've got an account, just log in as usual. Um, and when you've done that, just click the logo up the top and it will take you to this page. When you've done that, you're going to want to click download now. It may tell you to sign in again. If it does, just sign in again. And then it will tell you what version of ATS you'll need and ETS2. And then you've got the change log here. If you'd like to look at it. That doesn't actually work. I'm not too sure why. I think the change log is supposed to be here, but they're still working on the website. But that doesn't matter, it's not important. But when you're on this page, you're going to want to click this massive green download button. It's fairly obvious, just click that. And you'll get client underscore 20600.zip. You won't have the one, um, probably not, because that's, that, that's because I've already downloaded it. I did uninstall it for this tutorial though. So when you've done that, just open the zip file uh, with WinRAR or WinZip, anything like that and double click install truckersmp.exe it may come up with saying do you trust it you just want to click more and then run anyway and Norton may scan it and then just click run this program anyway because it is safe and then when a box comes up click yes so here we're in the setup you can close the WinRAR file in the background minimize don't close truckersmp just minimize that and you'll have this Pick your language, most of you are probably English or maybe Dutch. Hit OK. Click Next. Obviously read through this and accept. This doesn't really matter, I'd advise you to leave it where it is. Then click Next. And there's a few mods here. Um, well, there's three mods. ETS2 Multiplayer. For obviously Euro Truck Simulator 2 multiplayer and ATS multiplayer for American Truck Simulator multiplayer. This isn't needed. Um, personally, I wouldn't download that because it's not the time of year anymore. But you can, and that only works for Euro Truck Simulator 2 multiplayer. It won't uh, transfer snow on ATS. So when you've ticked the mods that you want, just click next. And then it will say, please select your American Truck Simulator directory. That'll normally be right, but if not, just select Steam, Steam Apps, Common, American Truck Simulator folder. Put it in there. Same for the Euro Truck Simulator 2. Just pick Steam, Steam Apps, Common, ETS2. Then click Next. And it will uh, create some shortcuts. Just allow that. Just click Next. I'd advise to create desktop icons so you can easily access it. Hit Next and Install. Fairly fast. And we have two new icons here for Euro Truck and then American Truck. Click finish. Before you jump into the action, you won't be able to with American Truck Simulator. You need to go onto the Truckers MP again and then go to the drop down called My Account. Click on Settings. And when you're on this page, make sure you've got settings at the side, it should be. Up at the top, it will say something like, I'm not too sure what it said now, but it says something like, activate American truck 
Um, if it says activate American truck, click activate and wait up to 60 minutes and it will scan your Steam to make sure you've had two hours game time and you're not banned from the other game. Mine took about a minute, um, but it says up to, thir up to 30 to 60 minutes sometimes. But that's peak times. If you do it now, right now, you should be fine. So, now you've done that, you can close Trucker's MP. Pick the game you want to play. I'm going to go American Truck. Just open that, and it will normally come up with a box. It'll normally come up with a box saying, would you like to run it? I'd advise to run it with DirectX. I figured out that I get more FPS with DirectX. So as you can see, hopefully, Trucker's MP, it should be right there on the screen. If not, I'm sorry, but it should be there. Anyway, fairly simple. You just log in with your account credentials on the main page. It's got your email password. Pick the server. Europe one's the best, most players. And then click play. Very simple. Anyway, thanks a bunch, guys, for watching. Do hope this helped. If it didn't help, if you have any problems, comment below. I will get back to you. Comments are checked daily, as I said in the last video. And thank you very much for watching. Please comment, thumbs up, and subscribe for more content.